Gorman now to that big game I mentioned earlier in the show. Bingham and Bishop Gorman meet again. This time it's in South Jordan. Last year the Miners suffered a heartbreaking loss to Bishop Gorman in overtime. Ever since that loss, they've been working hard, motivated not only by winning a third consecutive state title, but by the chance to avenge that loss in Las Vegas last season. I don't have to tell you how big this week is, do I? Oh, uh, no. It's a big week. He talking! Well, I'm very excited. I know for the t for the team, this is a really big game. I mean, statewide, it's a really big game. So um, the whole school is kind of buzzing. You know, the state's buzzing. Uh, it's going to be a really big game. Because of one state championships, what would it mean to you to beat a top 10 team in the country in this kind of situation? Well, in this kind of situation, it could possibly result in a national championship. So, I mean, that's just a whole new whole new level of things, like for the state of Utah, everything. A lot of us uh, played in uh, last year's game. We're regret regretting a lot of things that we did, but it's this is our time to come back. And lots of missed opportunities. Uh, lots of things that we could we could have made plays and that could have won the game. I mean, we only had two losses out of state games last year, and of course those are going to stick the most. It's probably going to be the biggest game that I personally have ever been in, and probably Bingham. It's going to be like nothing else Utah seen. It's been an amazing game. Well, good luck to the Miners tonight. Can't wait to see how that turns out. Well, football teaches.